Good morning, everybody. Yeah, say good morning. <laughs> he burped, and that was a that was a smelly burp. Oh my goodness! All right, so it is almost lunchtime. The kids are finishing up with school. Some are already done. It's about 12:45, so some of them are already done. The other ones are finishing up real quick, and then we're gonna eat lunch. I'm gonna make some peanut butter and jelly sandwiches. Some of the kids will probably have one for lunch, but I'm making a lot of them to go in the freezer. I bought two loaves of bread just for peanut butter and jelly sandwiches for the freezer in the last grocery haul. The kids already ate some of it, some of one of the loaves, so I'm just gonna use the rest of that one and the whole loaf to get some in the freezer. So we'll see how many we end up getting in there by the time some of the kids eat some for lunch. <laughs> I know Jacob and Jonah want a turkey pot pie though. They've already said that's what they want. So I'm gonna go ahead and get my bread ready here. We also have a little bit of pizza left over from last night. If nobody eats that for lunch, we'll have it to go with whatever we're having for supper tonight. All right, I've got the peanut butter and the jelly. I think Titus is actually gonna be cooking supper tonight. He called earlier and said that one of his customers is a meat cutter and he cut him two big steaks. So he said he's probably gonna cook those when he gets home, if he gets home in time. Ooh, you came back? Yeah? You wanna wash the dishes? He probably would try. He loves to throw stuff in the sink. He started throwing his toys in there again the other day. <laughs> Can't okay. eat it, it's not a drink. Yeah. yeah, it's not a drink, it's to wash your hands. Bye, Bye. snowman. Bye. Bye. I'm using these little sandwich cutters and I'm saving the crust cause I found a recipe for French toast muffins that we're gonna be making. So I'm saving the crust for that. I'm just gonna put it into a bag. I love grape jelly, grape or blackberry, which I'm gonna do some blackberry. Most of the kids' favorite with peanut butter and jelly is strawberry preserves. So that's what I'm putting on these right now. And now we seal it up. getting almost two bags of the peanut butter with strawberry preserves and one bag of peanut butter with blackberry preserves. Tyler, Aldra, and Jonna had a peanut butter and jelly sandwich for lunch and manly, yes. So here we go. I have all these crust pieces left over and we're gonna make French toast muffins with these. We'll probably have them for breakfast in the morning or I'll just stick them in the freezer for breakfast when anybody wants one. All you gotta do is take it out of the freezer and you could probably heat it up in the microwave. It said to reheat them in the oven, but I'm sure you could do it in the microwave. We'll try it sometime anyway. <laughs> I've never done French toast muffins before though, so we're gonna see how these turn out. In our big bowl here, we need one and a half cups of milk, two tablespoons of sugar, five eggs, one teaspoon of cinnamon, and two teaspoons of vanilla. Just whisking this all together. We need six cups of the bread cubes. So I'm gonna eyeball this about six cups here. Probably about what I have. And of course you can use different bread like French bread or whatever. I'm just using these, the crust from all that bread that I use. Okay, I'm gonna go ahead. There's a little bit more. I'm gonna go ahead and put the rest of it in here. And I'm just gonna dump the crumbs out of that bag and save my bag to put these in, the ones that I'm gonna put in the freezer. I'll probably just put them in the refrigerator tonight because we'll have them for breakfast in the morning and then whatever we don't eat, I'll put the rest of them in the freezer. All right, so we've got this all mixed together. I'm gonna sit it to the side, bring over the muffin tin. We're just gonna put some of this into each muffin tin. I'm probably gonna use, I'm gonna use my ice cream scoop. One of y'all gave me that tip the other day to use the ice cream scoop to put a cupcake batter in. Supposed to get 12 here, so if I have too much in some of them, I'll divide it between the empty ones here in a minute. 
I might get, yeah, I think it's going to be enough. Alright, so there's that. Now, we're going to make a topping to go on top of them. But you don't have to do this topping part. I'm going to use this little KitchenAid food chopper. I'm putting in a fourth of a cup of cold butter, half a cup of brown sugar, a fourth of a cup of all-purpose flour. Okay, we put in an eighth of a teaspoon of cinnamon and just a pinch of salt. Uh-oh. There we go. the muffins we're going to sprinkle this on the top of them and then they're going to go in the oven for about 25 minutes at 350. So I can tell y'all how they are. If these are good, it would be nice to do a big like four loaves of bread and make the homemade Uncrustables with them and make a bunch of these French toast muffins. All right, I'm putting just a little bit of maple syrup on top. Let's see. Okay, I was a little bit doubtful of how these would be using just a regular, you know, cheap white bread crumbs. Crust? <laughs> crumbs, not crumbs, crust. I was doubting it a little bit, but it's really good. You know, a lot of times the cheap bread, when you do French toast with it, it's it's just way too soggy. I thought that's how this was going to be, but it's not. Of course, it's not dry at all, but I thought it would just be mushy. Like, when I cut into it, I thought it would just, you know, all mush down. It didn't. Look at that. The muffin still held its shape and all. The muffin part itself is not very sweet. The topping is what gives the sweetness. So if you don't like very sweet French toast, you could totally leave the topping off. But if you do like for it to be sweet, you'll definitely need that topping. Next time I make some more homemade Uncrustables for the freezer, we'll definitely do this again with the crust. I'm sure these will be gone by tomorrow, so I don't think we'll have any for the freezer this time. <laughs> if your kids don't like crust, because we all know some kids do not like the crust on bread, make these French toast muffins. They're so good. Everybody's outside. They're outside waiting for Titus to get home today because there's a new batch of bottle calves coming in and they always get excited to see the new ones. These are a little bigger this time. I think they're expecting baby babies, but these are already a little bigger. I think only a couple of them are actually still on the bottle this time. I'm gonna do some laundry now. Manly is looking at the egg carton. It's clean, nobody fear. He's very amazed by it, but I'm watching him to make sure he doesn't try to eat it because he would try to eat it. He tries to eat everything. I think it. Yeah. Is that there? Open. Close. <gasps> it's amazing, the things that they find amazing. Thank you. He's done with it now. 